Behind another MVP performance from star quarterback Patrick Mahomes, the Chiefs erased a 10-point halftime deficit to topple the Eagles 38-35 in Super Bowl 57. Also in the news, a look at President Joe Biden's meeting with Brazilian President Luiz Inácio Lula da Silva and halftime performer Rihanna is pregnant with her second child. Now, here we go with Monday's news. Playing on an injured ankle, Kansas City Chiefs quarterback Patrick Mahomes threw two touchdown passes in the fourth quarter and scrambled 26 yards on the go-ahead drive before Harrison Butker kicked a 27-yard field goal with eight seconds left to give the Chiefs a 38-35 victory over the Philadelphia EA. MVP X2, Mahomes, who was named Super Bowl MVP for the second time just days after collecting his second league MVP award, was magnificent, despite aggravating his high ankle sprain late in the first half. More Super Bowl 57 coverage from USA Today One week since the most devastating earthquakes in recent history, workers in Turkey and Syria were searching for signs of life in freezing temperatures as the death toll surpassed 33,000 and survivors expressed frustration about the rescue efforts. The United Nations' top aid official on Sunday said aid efforts have failed the people in northwest Syria where more than 12 years of civil war have resulted in a complex political situation. As many as 5, 3 million people in Syria may need shelter, the UN Refugee Agency said, and the number of fatalities in both countries continues to rise. Read more? What's the weather today? Check your local forecast here. The U.S. military shot down an unidentified flying object over Michigan Sunday, the third in three days and fourth since downing a Chinese spy balloon off the coast of South Carolina February 4. Sunday's shootdown occurred hours after airspace had been temporarily closed over Lake Michigan by the Federal Aviation Administration and NORAD. The object had been flying at about 20, 000 feet over Lake Huron in a path and altitude that raised concerns about it being a hazard to civilian aviation, said Air Force Brig. General Pat Ryder, the Pentagon press secretary, shooting it down over the lake minimized the chances of injuring people or damaging property. Read more these articles are for USA Today subscribers. You can sign up here. Harry Styles won four prizes, including Album of the Year, at the U.K.'s Leading Music Awards Saturday, while female-led indie rock band Wet Leg took trophies for Group of the Year and Best New Artist. Styles took the Album of the Year trophy for Harry's House, less than a week after winning the same category at the Grammy Awards. He also won for Pop Slash R&B Act song of the year for as it was and artist of the year 